One of the most common issues that iPhone users face is trying to enable Wi-Fi on their iPhone, only to receive a grayed out toggle in return. If you're facing the same issue, here's how to fix Wi-Fi grayed out and get back to a working wireless connection. The first thing that you can do is quickly enable and then disable the airplane mode to allow your iPhone to set a fresh connection. To do this, just swipe down from the top right corner to access the control center and tap on the airplane icon to enable airplane mode. Wait for a minute or two and disable airplane mode. Try connecting to a Wi-Fi network again. If that doesn't work, the next thing you can do is restart your iPhone. Depending on your iPhone, you can use a combination of the side key and volume buttons to turn off your phone. Alternatively, you can open the settings app on your iPhone, navigate to general, and then tap on shut down. Let your phone shut down and press the side button to boot your iPhone after 30 seconds. You should be able to connect to Wi-Fi now. If not, you can try resetting the network settings. This will just reset the network settings while preserving all your data and apps. To do this, head over to the general section inside the settings app on your iPhone. Then tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Tap reset and select reset network settings. On the off chance that your issue still isn't resolved, the next step is to do a full reset. However, do keep in mind that this will affect all settings, including network settings, the keyboard dictionary, privacy settings, location settings, and Apple Pay cards. That being said, installed apps on your iPhone and other data remain unchanged. To do this, head over to the Transfer or Reset iPhone section, tap on Reset, and then tap Reset All Settings. The last thing that might be the cause of these problems is the software build itself. As such, you will have to update to the latest version of iOS. However, since Wi-Fi isn't working on your phone, you'll have to connect it to a Mac or Windows machine via USB. On Mac OS, open a Finder window and select your device in the left sidebar. Now click on General, then click on Check for Update. If a new update is available, then click on Download an Update and proceed to follow the on-screen instructions. Alternatively, if you are using a Windows machine, then download and install iTunes on it. Once done, launch the app and find your iPhone in there. Then click on Summary, followed by Check for Update. Proceed to do the on-screen instructions to easily update your iOS version. Hopefully, you are now able to easily connect to a Wi-Fi connection on your iPhone. If you like this guide, make sure to follow and subscribe to Guiding Tech for more tutorials for your iPhone and other tech products. And make sure to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.